You know just what you do, you do to me Play my emotions like a pair of puppet strings Did it ever occur to you, my heart's more than a toy Please go easy on me, babe Send message after message, forward my call Next day you hit me back like nothing happened at all what about all the things you used to say to me? This ain't the way it's supposed to be And you know I wouldn't do that to you You know I wouldn't treat you that way, no I've been running, can't catch up Oh love, what I won't do Chasing waterfalls Oh, you got me Chasing waterfalls All of the times I've been there Times I came through I'd meet you anywhere If it brought me closer to you Distance is killing me You make it so hard won't you let me love you, babe? Used to be optimistic These days I just don't know Pick a fence in the valley I hope it's losing its hold You know the mother girls will love you like I do Can't afford to give up on you And you know I wouldn't do that to you You know I wanna treat you that way, no I've been running, can't catch up Oh love, what I won't do Oh, you got me Chasing waterfalls Oh, you got me Chasing waterfalls Oh, 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 you've got me Chasing waterfalls Oh, 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 you've got me Chasing waterfalls Oh, oh, oh. oh you got me Chasing waterfalls Oh, you got me Chasing waterfalls oh, oh. You know just what you do, you do to me Play my emotions like a pair of puppet strings Did it ever occur to you, my heart's more than a toy Please go easy on me, babe Send message after message, forward my call Next day you hit me back like nothing happened at all what about all the things you used to say to me? This ain't the way it's supposed to be And you know I wouldn't do that to you You know I wouldn't treat you that way, no I've been running, can't catch up Oh love, what I won't do Chasing waterfalls Oh, you got me Chasing waterfalls 
All of the times I've been there, times I came through I'd meet you anywhere if it brought me closer to you Distance is killing me, you make it so hard Won't you let me love you, babe? Used to be optimistic, these days I just don't know Pick a fence in the valley, a hope is losing its hope you know the mother girls will love you like I do Can't afford to give up on you And you know I wouldn't do that to you You know I wouldn't treat you that way, no I've been running, can't catch up Oh love, what I won't do Chasing waterfalls Oh, you got me Chasing Like a pair of puppet strings Did it ever occur to you My heart's more than a toy Please go easy on me, babe Send message after message Forward my call Next day you hear me back Like nothing happened at all What about all the things You used to say to me this ain't the way it's supposed to be And you know I wouldn't do that to you You know I wouldn't treat you that way, no I've been running, can't catch up Oh love, what I won't do Chasing waterfalls Oh, you got me Chasing waterfalls All of the times I've been there Times I came through I'd meet you anywhere If it brought me closer to you Distance is killing me You make it so hard won't you let me love you, babe? Used to be optimistic These days I just don't know Pick a fence in the valley I hope it's losing its hold You know the mother girls will love you like I do Can't afford to give up on you And you know I wouldn't do that to you You know I wanna treat you that way, no I've been running, can't catch up Oh love, what I won't do Oh, you got me Chasing waterfalls Oh, you got me Chasing waterfalls Chasing waterfalls 
this is the finished result. Um, this is how everything's looking. So I really do like all the products. Um, yeah, so we'll talk about the products. And I'm going to show y'all the palette. Because y'all, I think I'm going to keep this palette. I really don't want to... Excuse me. I really don't want to return this palette. Um, I really like it. And you tell me what y'all think about it. Do you think it's evil? Or do you think it's like... I mean... We'll talk about it in a little bit. I'm kind of disappointed in this um, as far as the video because I had plans on using that palette. I had waited all the way to 5 p.m. actually when the mail carrier came. And usually they don't take that long, but I waited that long and um, I was going to create a look with that palette. And I feel like, you know what, it's what's in the heart that means the most and not so much about a package. Um, it's just the front cover. So, y'all, let me just go ahead and let's talk about these products. And then I'll show y'all the palette. Y'all tell me what y'all think about it. I mean, I feel like if I could take off that, that cover and put on another one, um, everything would be so much better. And maybe I can figure that out. Uh, but I really do like this palette. But anyways, y'all, let's talk about um this product right here. Oh my God, this is so pretty. Um, that's what I used on my lids, as y'all know, like right here. And then I went in with the um, the Complex Couture, Couture Complex, Complex Couture Palette, the bronzer palette to um, deepen up the uh, crease, which is a matte formula. But this is really nice. This is also good to contour with. Um, I will contour with this when I do a natural look, like something a little softer as far as the foundation and all that. That's when I would use this. I thought I would be able to use it today, but I don't know what I was thinking about. But look at the eye makeup. I love this. It's very, very natural and um, very wearable for every day, except, you know, the wing is a little bold and no, they're not even, okay? I know, don't tell me. But anyways, you guys, I mean, even with the wing liner, it's, this look is very wearable and it's very um, everyday appropriate. But this is so good. I'm glad I got it. And yeah, there's another shade, but it's sold out. So as soon as that other shade come available, I will repurchase this. In fact, I'm going to look and see if it's available so I can... Um, be sure to get another one of these products. Get the other product. But this is so creamy, so smooth. It creased just a little bit, but not too much. I don't know how, how it will do uh, if I have it on more than, say, two or three hours. I don't know. Uh, but it's beautiful anyways, and I love it. It's creamy and easy to blend and you can easily put this on by itself and wear it every day so i like that about this product so yeah very very good um the next product would be i finally got me some of these um makeup sponges that everybody use what a difference okay i used to use the brush to try to come close to the nose if you contour the nose area and you really want to get in there and get underneath the eyes and add on your product they say you can use this also with um like any kind of foundations and all that stuff i do have a plenty of them over there i think i have eight pieces i have uh this one here and then i have another one in here i thought i would use with foundation but this is so pretty and it adds that powder underneath the eyes just right and it really did highlight my under eyes so i absolutely love this i don't know why it took me so long to get this because <laughs> so many people have been talking about this product for a long long time and i don't know why it took me so long to get it but i love that okay that's a new product okay now, these others I've used already, so the, the two new products was those two products right there. Everything else I have used, but we'll talk about it again. The Absolute Full Coverage Liquid Matte Foundation Full Coverage High Pigment. Um, this product, be careful. <laughs> Y'all saw how 
everything look like be careful when you put this on you only need a small amount i said that the first time i used this product and all you need is very very little okay um another thing i would say uh use a beauty blender i feel like a beauty blender it looks better it looks it smooths out better um i think with the foundation brush it's just it, the the product is just too thick with the foundation brush however i did use like a flat eyeshadow or not eyeshadow but a flat foundation brush um maybe with a, another different kind of brush like the one i used last time this one worked better so i think a flat top kabuki brush is the best i didn't use it today but i think that would be the best brush to use um but this is very good if you need a lot of coverage um it's amazing for covering up a lot of things and also remember if you have a lot of texture i feel like this product can bring that out or stick that out so just know that that this could actually uh cause your your textured areas to stick out a little more maybe because it's full coverage or whatnot so i would say like the first time i used this product i used the uh, sephora pore um minimizer or whatever this is what I use right on my cheeks, and I can tell the difference without using this. I put it on my cheeks, on my forehead. Do y'all remember that? Um, and it was way much smoother. So use a pore, um, like the Poreless Primer by ELF or this right here by Sephora. Any kind of pore pro uh, product that you can put on to smooth your pores, then put this on if you have a lot of pores like enlarged pores um so this will not you know expose those poor um uh, enlarged pore um uh, areas so yeah you guys this is good okay i still recommend it I think it's a wonderful foundation if you're looking for great great coverage so yeah this does it and my makeup looks amazing right now uh the makeup look is different from the previous makeup look but does it look amazing i think so i think my makeup look awesome so yeah you guys this is yes a yes for me i love it okay so highly recommend those absolute new york full cover liquid matte foundation okay the next one oh my god i love these I love these. This is the, um, I say she, but it's S dot H E, but I say she makeup and it's, uh, the dream stain liquid blush. I use this one on my cheeks and a little bit on my lips tonight. Okay. So yeah, it looks good. I like it. This is very intense. Um, very beautiful color. Look at it on my cheeks. So, so beautiful. It's going to be great for the summer months as it is the summer time. Okay. Right now. So yeah, you guys like this is gorgeous. Love it. And I love this shade. This is, um, shade four. <laughs> okay. This is a shade four. So I really, really like this one. And this is more like that vibrant pink color uh sort of like yeah a vibrant pink so i really like that and so yeah you guys i love it a lot and we'll be using these products over and over i cannot wait to use the more intense shade okay so anyways i have also these flawless perfect concealers here by zor uh these are very nice so good underneath the eyes as well as contour bronzing oh my goodness i got every shade for all of that tonight i use the shade bronze and cocoa love these two shades i use the bronze first if i want a natural contour shade and then i use the shade cocoa so yeah that's the intensify the shade and all of that i can see myself putting this on maybe for fast makeup as far as just you know putting a little bit on my crease there yes um but then it's 
it's moisturizing so I wouldn't have to set everything but at the same time I do think these are amazing concealers I use it underneath my eyes the light shade and the shade hmm which ones did I use light and I think it was beige I think those two shades right there is what I use underneath my eyes and then I use these to bronze so once again this is the bronze shade and the cocoa shade so very very nice concealers love the applicators okay I've talked about it and highly recommend these products okay because I got these for a dollar each what a deal Okay, so the other thing is just this mascara. What can I say about this mascara? All I can say about this mascara is... Hmm, I really... I'm starting to say... I'm going to say this. Okay, when I first used this mascara, I thought, okay, it's okay. Um, and it is okay. Uh, the thing is... I don't know what it is. It's just... The formula is just so moisturizing. Maybe I need to wait and let it get dry or whatnot. Uh, when it comes down to really moisturizing uh, mascaras, um, you know, I don't like my mascara too dry, but I don't like it really moisturizing. And so when I put the mascara on, um, it just creates a mess, okay? A little bit of a mess. So, I'm okay. I got Q-tips to clean up, you know, underneath my lash line or whatnot when I get this on. When you're in a fast, quick pace and you need to get done, then this right here, you're probably not going to want to use because this is just... It's just really moisturizing. But I do like the fact that you can um, keep the brush straight or you can bend it. It's just up to you, okay? But anyways, y'all, that is just a little bit too messy of a mascara. It's just too moisty, okay? So, yeah, y'all, I'm just saying that. And I said it before uh, when I first used this mascara. But I'm going to use this mascara because I'm not going to let it just sit up here and I never use it. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm going to use that mascara. So, y'all, that's basically the products. That's basically the products that I use. And um, I told y'all I had some new products. And, oh, I did not talk about my skincare. Here we go. So, this right here is really nice. Uh, this here is the Laguna Moon Moisture Boost Cream. It's hypoallergenic. It repairs skin barrier, and it's for all skin types. And, y'all, it has blueberries in it, if you can see. Okay, so let me tell you a little bit about this product. Um, love the applicator and everything. I think that is really, really cool. I'm glad I got this. I love it. I'll be repurchasing over and over. So that's like a seal, y'all, to keep it really fresh and sealed. You just push that in there, and yeah, that is so good. It's so unique. I do like the fact that when I put it on, it did absorb. I felt the moisture, and then it absorbed into the skin. It felt really nice on my skin. So I really, really like this. And I would say using this, you don't need a lot of foundation. This might be why, but I know that that, that foundation, you just really don't need a lot of it. But I feel like using a product, a good moisturizer like this, you only need a dab of foundation. Then if you need extra foundation, then go back in with more. Because I do think this kind of contributed to why my foundation looks so thick. Um, thicker than it did last time I used that um, Absolute New York Full Cover Liquid Matte Foundation. I feel like this has something to do with it. Um, I don't know, y'all. But I'm just saying I do think this right here did like because see it says it repairs skin barrier so that is on top of the skin right so i feel like this has something to do with the foundation going on so thick but let me tell you a little bit more about this product here i got the box here it tells a little bit more this product has hyaluronic acid 
It has uh, bat batine, batine. It has trial, oh, y'all. T R E H A L O S E. It has aloe vera, chamomile, and it has A S A. Wait, A S I A T I C. P-E-N-N-Y-W-O-R-T. I'm not going to even try to pronounce that because I don't want to pronounce it the wrong way. And then it has honeysuckle in it, which I didn't even know, okay? So it has all those ingredients, and uh, this is... Um, the benefits of the product is packed with moisturizing ingredients, it says. The fast absorbing formula instantly quenches the thirsty skin by providing intense and long lasting hydration, leaving your skin feeling supple, smooth, soft, and radiant. And I agree with that. So that's just a little bit of information about it. Like I said, I have to do some reviews, y'all. And as soon as I can, I'm going to start doing some reviews. That's going to be some of the videos over here. It's just reviews, giving y'all more information about some of these new products. But first, I want to use these products. And so I can give y'all thorough reviews, okay? So I love this product. This is a wonderful skincare product. And then this um, pre-makeup refresh hydrating primer here. Uh, this is by She Makeup here. It's this one right here. And I don't have the information about it, but I did use this on top of this here. And yeah, maybe I think I will probably use this separate next time and then use this separate okay i won't use it together okay just use this when i want to use this and use this when i want to use this so i feel like maybe for fast days or whatnot but i feel like i'm gonna reach for this more than i will this okay but i like both products okay and you can use them together um but i just feel like this is going to be my favorite so yeah it has blueberries and i feel like that's going to be so good for the skin blueberries y'all blueberries is an antioxidant so do you know what i'm saying like that is really good for the skin so i feel like this is going to be my favorite because i'm all about the natural uh, makeup natural skin care uh, natural ingredients type of skin care so I saw this and I thought yes I'm gonna get this okay I love the package as well very unique so I believe that's all of the new products that I put on and showed y'all and so stay tuned for more um like I said real quick y'all I got a new set of brushes here um, I will use this in an upcoming uh, video. These brushes, y'all going to be shocked at how much I paid for these brushes. I have every brush that I need to create eye makeup looks as well as liners and also as face uh, brushes. I have all of them right here, okay? All of them, face brushes, eye brushes, all that I need. And then you have this wonderful um, brush holder or case here amazing for traveling and also for just keeping your brushes in here like you ain't got to lay them out you can keep them in this and keep them secured or whatnot in your uh vanity drawer or whatnot y'all so i got this that's also a new product um these sponges once again i got a whole pack of these sponges that i showed you the new one that has the shape here that i use the triangle shape i have those right there and then what else do i have um that came in oh yes this palette y'all the icon uh warm nights eyeshadow palette by absolute new york which is by the same brand that creates the mascara i have this palette i didn't want to use it i'm gonna save it so yeah you guys i got that um just taking advantage of these inexpensive products and having new products in my collection because a lot of these 
older products that I have, I will be decluttering. And so I got some new products. So I'm very happy because it's time to, uh, you know, get some new makeup. It's been time. So, yeah, y'all, I think that's about it for today's for us. Oh, yeah, the palette. Let me show it to you real quick. This is by Beauty Glaze. I have bought other Beauty Glaze uh, products. And, um, yeah, I remember buying them and all that. I'm going to show y'all the eyeshadows first before I show you the cover. Some of y'all going to say, you just over-exaggerated, Sheila. But, y'all, this is what the colors look like. Like They're vibrant. They're perfect for the summer. We've got some neutral tones. Do y'all see the tones in this palette? Like, look at that. So beautiful. Like, look at that. Okay. So, what I noticed before I bought this palette, y'all, and the names on here, I'm fine. I looked at the names of everything. The names are perfectly fine. They're not bad names at all. But then, when you look at it, um, the they have two other palettes. One has a deer on it with the, um, you know, the, what you call it, the... You know, one has a deer on it, which I thought was really, really cute. And then I don't know what the other one has on it, but they seem to have, like, different, uh, like, animals. This one happens to have, look like a bull. So it says, Dreaming Up is the name of it, and this is what it looks like. Now, I don't like anything that looks evil. Um, it doesn't really look evil, but when you think of the bull, the bull do have horns, right? So, <laughs> this is what's bothering me. Some people would probably say, girl, what are you talking about? That is nothing. But, y'all, this is what the pal palette looked like. And, but the colors inside is so beautiful. Um, y'all can see a, another makeup look with me using that palette if you're interested. There's going to be several makeup looks because I have like so many things to show y'all. There's some things I haven't even opened up yet. I haven't even used yet. And then there's some that is the same product but just different shade or whatnot like contour shades and all that stuff. So you'll be able to see all of that. So stay tuned you guys. There is more makeup looks as well as I told y'all something else. I'm going to start doing some reviews. As I wear this makeup I'm going to do reviews and all that. So stay tuned for that you guys and everything. So yeah y'all just stay tuned for more videos more um, review videos, more fashion videos. That's what I'm about to do next is a fashion look. And so, yeah, um, I hope y'all enjoyed this video and yeah, just saying not only my beauty supply store products, y'all, I still haven't used some of my like ELF uh, what is it? Eyeshadow pencils and my heart candy products. Some of my other blushes that I got from Amazon. I haven't even showed y'all a lot. Those eyeshadow palettes. I haven't really showed y'all those yet. These beautiful eyeshadow palettes and those contour uh, palettes yet. So we've got a lot, okay? But you know what? This is my new makeup because I'm about to throw away all of my older makeup. I would say the makeup I've used for a while, okay? All the makeup I need is right here, okay? Everything else I am throwing out and, yeah, replacing it with these things. So, yeah, so if you, if you want to see all of those products, so stay tuned. And, yeah, you guys, you'll see some more looks with some new products so if you're into inexpensive makeup then you need to stay tuned i appreciate look at something flying through here do y'all see that <laughs> if y'all want to see more makeup looks and reviews and first impressions and all that stay tuned i appreciate all of y'all and i've got some editing to do because I don't know what happened. When I got that palette, I got all mesmerized. All like, what am I going to do? That palette is so beautiful. Now I know what to do. Okay, so yes. 
I'm going to use those eyeshadows. So, yeah, you guys, I love y'all a lot. I will see y'all my next one. Take care, everybody. I love y'all. Much love, care, kindness, peace, joy, and happiness to everyone and also for myself. And I will see y'all my next one. And y'all, look at this makeup look. Y'all know that it's over in the evening. There's no natural lighting. Ain't no need of me getting back for y'all to take a look at it because it's just going to be a shadow. So y'all see everything. I hope y'all love the look, okay? I love it. I love the eyeshadow. It's just a very simple look. And I might even create the same eyeshadow look tomorrow because it's so natural. It's so beautiful. And I do love the... Uh, the pink cheeks and all that. It is just absolutely gorgeous. I love this look. So also I use the same thing on my lips and I kind of like sheared it out a little bit. But yeah, you guys, I love the look. I hope y'all love this look and I will see y'all my next one. So y'all take care of yourselves. And once again, much love, care, kindness, peace, joy, happiness to everyone. Also for myself. And I will see y'all my next one. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>